Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome back, bitches. No, just kidding. So, yeah, guys. Uh, so we're back with some more Need for Speed. We're gonna be doing more multiplayer races, farming up money, because it's a fucking pain in the ass to make money in this game. <laughs> I'm not sure if any of you guys have noticed. You literally get like about 20 grand for getting first place. And that's if you're lucky and you have a somewhat like a full playlist of people in the lobby itself, if that makes sense. But so far it's been pretty fun, but to be honest I kind of like the the sense of progression that the game is not easy if that makes sense. Like you don't see everyone rolling around fucking like Ferraris and Lamborghinis and shit. I mean probably not now because the game uh, just came out. But for the most part everyone is still trying to grind and get their money. So we're gonna be doing some more B-class races today and our end goal right now to be honest is just to get the RX-7. But in order to even unlock that car. We need to get uh, 30, we need to complete I think 30 B-list races which is fucking an insane amount of races considering that every race consists of 3 tracks that can take anywhere from a good uh, 10 to 15 minutes to complete. So yeah there's that. But the good thing is whenever you complete challenges you do get a shit ton of money. So that is uh, very helpful. Yeah. So yeah, anyways, <laughs> that's what goes on in my uh, crazy ass uh, psychopath mind right there, guys. Uh, let me see, damn, I lost my train of track right now. Oh yeah, anyways, uh, we're gonna be doing, yeah, basically uh, more B tier races, just keep farming money. Uh, I haven't really, well, our next goal is, well, uh, I guess I do have an A class car built up, so future video idea, I have like a police interceptor. That you can like uh, just go around ramming people with. Because this game actually rewards you for ramming people. I'm not sure if you guys have noticed. But if you're going like 100 miles per hour and you ram someone and you knock them out. Like it will literally fill up your boost gauge to max. So I was like alright this game encourages ramming. So, <laughs> And I'm not sure uh, So how, the, how races work. It's all live on a single map. So let's say yeah, that you're racing with like 8 other people. But there will still be people free roaming on the map itself, but I'm not sure if collision between the people who are free roaming and the people who are racing are enabled. So that's definitely something I want to mess with and just like just throw around ramming people and just fucking up the races. I think, I think it'll be funny. <laughs> it is need for speed, so. Alright guys, we are at the meet spot. I will see you soon. Hey everyone, we are in the queue. Well, I wouldn't say in the queue, but we were able to find a race. Welcome back. Oh, and by the way, I forgot to mention if you guys have not joined my discord feel free to join it's linked down below in the description uh if you guys want to race with me just hop on and chill i'll be more than happy uh to hang out with you in fact i'm actually looking for new people to play this game with because i've just been playing solo so yeah hope you guys enjoy let's fucking gap these kids Oh, another thing I forgot to mention, I'll be here, I'll just be in and out, just popping out as needed if that makes sense. <laughs> I just wanna like not distract you guys from watching the uh, the gameplay video. But I've basically uh, just pre-recorded the full thing, I just do a voiceover. Just digesting, uh, digesting, I, I, I don't know the right word, fuck it. So anyway, just breaking down the contents or the race itself if that makes sense and how we can improve and become better. Alright, you, you guys had to admit that was a pretty sick uh, like little mini drift around the whole fucking corner and we are fucking gapping these kids. They are literally like 100, almost 200 yards behind me right now. <laughs> Guys, I'm sorry. You already know I had to do that. Yeah, that's need for speed. This is like the like the Call of Duty of racing. Like you have to be fucking toxic on here. 
All right, we are back with another race. This will be uh, the last one, guys. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, so technically I've done like uh, two full races, like uh, three races is one if that makes sense. So it's just two full ones, and we've won both. So I, I just wanna like break it down so it's not like super boring content. So I just have like one race here and then. But our main goal right now is just the uh, farm money, the boring cards. So eventually there, we will be building cards, and I'm also oh look at this bitch, he just smacked the shit out of me. But yeah, eventually I will be like building cars and I'll show you guys my garage. I have like a shit ton of cars already built. So I probably have like three or four. It might not be a lot, but trust me, uh, when it takes like like 100 to 200k uh, just to build like a B-class car, that is a lot of fucking money uh, considering that one part will cost like 40, 50 grand, if that makes sense. So we'll slowly get there guys, enjoy this race. Uh, of course, you know I always get number one, so there's no uh, need to stress. Oh, and one more thing I want to mention to you guys, I'm just talking shit, I'm not like the best. I have raced against people on here that have whooped my ass, so I just want to put that out there right now. <laughs> like, I'm not saying that my Civic build is like the number one build, but it's like, I would say top 5%. There have been some people that have beat me, and that have come close to me, but it's still within like the top 5%, so. But at the end of the day, it all just comes down to a driver, like, error, if that makes sense. Like, you need to know when you can and when you can't drift. Like, right there I fucked up and I lost a bunch of speed because of my car, like, under turned or under steering. So yeah, let's keep uh, enjoying the race, guys. Telling you guys, it's uh too easy, too easy. <laughs> and these people, like they aren't like uh like like class well. Like some of these guys are fully maxed out. Like two of these people in this lobby are like the full like 159, and then we're still beating them by like a good like five second difference, which is fucking insane. Oh, and by the way, guys, uh, I'm still trying to like work out like the layout. If that makes sense, I'm probably gonna end up moving like where the webcam is and the Xbox controller somewhere else. Just so you guys can see more of the GUI a bit better. Okay, so I just wanted to know that we got a perfect launch and do you guys see how crazy uh, and OP this car is? If you get a fucking perfect launch, no one is fucking catching you on this car. Like, this is insane. We already gained 100 yards on them, which is fucking ridiculous. Alright, let me, uh, let you guys keep watching. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, but this, this car is insane. And then keep in mind, this isn't like the best car out there, I would say. So I'm kind of curious what's going to happen like when all the Meta like, vehicles come out, if that makes sense. Like, oh, like this will be like the number one B class, or this will be like the number one like A class, you get me? Which is the fun part about this game right now, because no one has really discovered what those cars are. So if you are able to figure them out at an early stage, you can have a lot of fun and farm a lot of money easily in this game. So yeah, I, I highly recommend you guys choose a the Civic, the 2000 Honda Civic Type R hatchback as your starting vehicle.
Yeah, once 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 you get those perfect launches, there's there's no catching this car. I made a few videos in the past where I would always fuck it up, but now I kind of figured out how to like launch perfectly. So you just have to align the throttle with the little green bar, and with this car is fucking insane. But keep in mind, our weakness is our top speed, so we cap out at 120 miles per hour. So we do not go any faster than that. So this track would really uh, push this car to its limit or test it, if that makes sense. <clears throat> yeah, but by the way, you should all be clapping. That's the quarter where I always fuck up and crash. Like, I've literally have crashed into that wall like 20 fucking times, by the way. So like I finally figured out like how not to crash into it anymore. So yeah, and that's the other thing I've noticed about this game. Uh, once you do like a few of the races, like it's just the same tracks over and over again. I'm really hoping they add like new variety and new tracks. Uh, because you select the track you want to do and it's literally just like the same tracks over and over again. I really hope they add uh, more randomness. Because you get to a point where you just learn the track by memory and that's very fucking OP because you will make less mistakes that way, if that makes sense. But yeah, we're just uh, taking these kids to uh, Applebee's, uh, sorry, I meant to say uh, Gapplebee's, just handing out the gap sauce left and right. But, Tell you what, if you guys uh, donate me $10, I'll let you know what my civic build is. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I, I said this already, so just forget about speed, just build acceleration. And I guess you could do that with any uh, any B-class vehicle, if that makes sense. But I would say that get like a car that already has good acceleration to begin with. If, and then don't focus on speed is the best way to go. But yeah, we had a 6 uh, second difference, which is fucking insane if you ask me. Like, that should not be happening. Like, if this was Forza, like, you would not see, like, a gap that difference. But, like, I kind of like that about this game. Alright, number one, like always. And I also wish there was a way that you can keep track of your leaderboards, I guess. Like, there's no real way of checking, like, uh, how many races you've won or, you know. But yeah, see you guys again soon. And oh yeah, don't forget to join the Discord. Please join, I need new friends.